Willkommen zurück zu einer weiteren Folge Sherlock Holmes. So, mal schauen, wie lange der Fall sich noch hinzieht. Mr. Holmes, we found the sailors from that list you gave us. Well done, Wiggins. Let me see. Okay. Der ist gestorben. This man is a harpooner. And his initials are PC, the same initials that were found on the tobacco pouch. Ich habe jetzt nur geraten, also. Wiggins, ja. could you gather some information on one of the sailors that you found? His name is Patrick Cairns. Einige Zeit später. We found Patrick Cairns. Good job, Wiggins. Where is he? He lives in a small furnished dump of a room, but he's always at the Sea Witch Pub. Where he does arm wrestles for money and drinks. Excellent. Here is your reward. Two guineas. Thank you, sir. So. Johnny Sand Kangle. Besatzung hat sie ausfindig gemacht. Äh, das da. If I wish to speak to Cairns without alarming him, I had better dress as a sailor. Okay. Du, 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 du. Der Puddel voll rum. Now I can approach Cairns and see if he recognizes the pouch. Alter, bist du immer draußen hell. Drücken wurde gesagt. Und es muss ein kräftiger Kerl sein. Der hier. Jo, gönn dir, Bruder. Hallo, there. Are you Cairns? What do you want? We've heard all about the gambling and arm wrestling here. You seem like the likely sort, and I'm up for it. Start at ten shillings. Suits me. Oh, no, nee, it's wish gegen den Arm drücken or wie? Alter. Schaff mal. Nein, hör auf. Wir gewinnen. Wir gewinnen das! Ey, 
Ey, das wäre mal ein Gewinn. Der guckt schon so. Na, lass uns gewinnen. Wir sind Sherlock Holmes. Naja, gut. Schade. <lacht> das ist die Arme, die 100 Wilds killt. Kehrt ihr noch 10 Schilling? Ich gebe auf. Ja, yeah. ich hatte genug. Du bist zu stark. Komm zurück, später, wenn du deine Arme wieder benutzen kannst. Allerdings. Ich muss das gewinnen oder wie? Was ist denn das für eine Kacke? Die gelben Fingernägel kommen vom Zigarettendrehen. Aber hier fehlt noch irgendwas. Hä? Ja. Yeah. Oh, you've had enough. Come back later when you can use your arms again. <laughs> ich muss ernsthaft gegen den gewinnen? Was ist denn das? Kacke. I'm ready to try again. Fine. If you want me to take all your money, no problem with that. Okay. Ich kann es überspringen, wenn ich es jetzt nicht schaffe. Betrachte den Gesichtsausdruck von Patrick Keynes, um seine Reaktion zu erkennen. Attackieren, verteidigen, warten und reagieren Sie dann entsprechend. Ey, das ist gar nicht so einfach.
Aber ich will, dass die Folge noch zum Erfolg kommt, deswegen... Wir überspringen das einfach mal. Wir wollen den Fall ja lösen und nicht nur rumspielen. Ich hatte genug. Du bist zu stark. Komm zurück später. Du kannst deine Arme wieder Ich will jetzt hier mal Ergebnisse sehen. Hallo? Da eventuell ich jetzt äh, 10.000 Mal überspringen muss. Das ist mir Latte. Ich bin bereit, es zu versuchen. Fein. Wenn du mich willst, dann nehme ich all dein Geld. Ja, komm. hier vorankommen. Well, good for you, I reckon. You're stronger than you look. Here's your ten shillings. We'd like to buy you a drink. Good winner as well. That's good. Let's have a drink. Wir kommen weiter. Das ist schon mal das Positive. You're a good type. Seems you've managed to settle down in life. You've got money, eh? Not all that much. Oh, well. At least you're not as poor as me. Why do you say poor? You're not working? I'm a harpooner. But you see, the whalers are rare. They don't pay much. So, as a result, I find myself arm wrestling to pay well, for my drink. Think, A harpooner. Interesting. You've had a lot of adventures, I bet. Ah, of course. It's been a dozen years since I've sailed. I've seen everything. Old Wallace, damn Black Peter, Great Roger. We sailed to the Cape of Good Hope. Der Schwarzpeter. Black Peter, you say? I've heard rumors about that one. He was worse than all. He was a liar. Violent too, swinging those fists of his around. It's a tyrant, and not much of a captain. At least, not as good as Great Roger. I see. Yes, I was told terrible tales about Black Peter. But you ain't heard the worst. Tell me, and let's have another drink. It was in 1883 that it happened. The August of that year. Peter Carey was captain of the Sea Unicorn, and I was a spare harpooner. We were coming out of the ice pack on our way home. One evening, we saw a little craft that had been blown north. There was only one man on her, and he wasn't a sailor. The crew must have thought that she had foundered, and they made for the Norwegian coast in the dinghy. I guess they all drowned. We took the man on board. And who was he? I don't know. During the crossing, he and the skipper enjoyed some long talks. His baggage was just a tin box. That's okay. strange enough. Aye. Even stranger was that on the second night, he disappeared. Nobody knew what happened to him. And of course, nobody could ask Black Peter about it. You know what happened, don't you? I do. I saw the skipper tie his heels and push him over the rail in the middle of my watch on that dark night. Two days before we sighted the Shetland lights. Ooh. Black Peter's a murderer. Aye. Those that know him wouldn't be surprised to hear it. But all this must stay between us. All right? Of course. Back in a second. I'm off to the Aussie. 
I'll be here with my drink. Okay. Toilette. Here it is. So, have you got any tobacco? We've run out of mine. Nah, I lost my pouch. I don't know where. Wait a minute. What's this? Oh, is this your tobacco pouch? Well, oh, oh, it is. Well, I have to go now. I know a captain who's planning an expedition to Cape Cod. Captain Ahab's his name. He commanded the Pequod. He might need good harpooners. I'll tell him about you. Maybe, if you like, I. <laughs> Alles klar. I'm done here. It's time to leave. Yeah. zu Baker Street. You met Patrick Kens, the harpooner. Do you believe he's the murderer? Okay, da finden wir nichts. Weitergeht, erfahren wir in der nächsten Folge. Bis dahin, bleibt entspannt, genießt den Tag. Bye, bye.